Hi, in this video we're going to show you how to set up email rules for the Microsoft Outlook.com or the Outlook Live uh, webmail interface. So if you have the uh, Outlook desktop clients, you might be familiar with rules and how to set them up. This works in a similar way. And what you could do with those is you could kind of tell Outlook what you want to do with certain emails um, as they come in. So we're going to set up a simple one here just to show you how it works. And then you could try it out for yourself. So what you want to do is go to the Outlook settings, gear icon here then view all Outlook settings, and then rules. And we don't have any rules, so we're gonna create a new one. We'll call this uh, Danny. And so what we're gonna do is, if it's from Daniel Sims, try that again, Daniel Sims 007 at gmail.com, what we're gonna do is mark it as junk, so it'll send it right to the trash. And then we're going to add an. You could you could add other actions if you want to fine tune it. We're going to add an exception now, and I'll show you how that works. So, and let's say if the su subject or body includes. Okay, so what we have here is the email rule, Danny. The condition: if we get an email from Daniel Sims at 007, Daniel Sims 007 at gmail.com, we're going to mark it as junk unless the subject or body includes sales files. And then we'll save it. And there it is, and you could run it manually. You can move your rules around if you have multiple rules, which ones you want to run first. You could edit it by clicking on that to go back into it, or you could delete it with that. So we want to test it by going to here and do a new email to Cindy, which is our Outlook user here. So if Daniel just says, hi, Cindy, sends it off. Let's see what Cindy gets here. Okay, so it went right to her, her junk mail here. So there's the hi, Cindy uh, email. Okay, so let's go back and test our exception. So compose a new one. Cindy. Uh, sales files was our phrase that we're going to allow as our exception. So let's send that off. Go back to our email. Yep. So now it didn't go to the trash. So we have one in our inbox here with the sales files, which is allowed, and then the hi Cindy went to the junk mail. So once again, settings, view all Outlook settings, rules, and then you can make a new rule and, and play with it here. They tend to be a little buggy, I've noticed, especially on exceptions. So, you know, depending on what you add here, I've seen where sometimes it works and sometimes it doesn't, so you're gonna have to play around with it and uh, test it out and see how it works for yourself. But anyways, you know, just go go ahead and make some rules and just play with all the settings here and you'll get the hang of it. It's pretty self-explanatory once you uh, start working with them and kind of build out your rule and then you should be good to go. All right, thanks for watching and be sure to subscribe. Mm -hmm.